Do we have a dressing driver here? Yes. 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 Remember, driving is a continuous learning process. So, according to the small research, you know, when I was building this module, some, there are some questionnaires you give people and, and that you, you take them. You find that two out of three drivers still insist on seeing themselves as near perfect drivers with almost no room to improve. If the driver stands his ground, he has got no mistakes, he doesn't make mistakes, he's not able to improve. He will never improve because his own standard, he has done it. So, aggressive drivers see the other person as the problem and certainly do not look at their own aggressive driving behavior. When we start seeing others as a problem, in the convoy, he believes other drivers can just bring problems, so he can't give chance. <laughs> 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 I want to read this Okay, oh, fine. Those ones I want to post. Those who want to post. I'm not talking about buy. Oh, buy. They want to find any leads. Oh, okay. He's talking about the buy. So now, <coughs> see anger as the root cause of the problem. We agree. Yes. It is ultimately our emotional state, our stress, our, our, our stress level, and our thinking patterns that either cause us to drive aggressively or lead us to be 